All right, surprise everybody. Surprise time. That's right. All right, we're doing a thing. I'm super nervous about it, but it needed to be done. There's hardware here. Behold, no computer. The computer is streaming, yeah, obviously, but we're gonna make music with hardware. We're gonna learn together, and I'm terrified about it, so let's see how it goes. Okay, first, I'm gonna get some samples up in the Dr. Sampler. I'm gonna get them today from the Talking Whiz Kid. Today is Talking Whiz Kid Day, so let's see what we get. Insert card. Hmm, insert that card. Okay, we got this, uh, quadriverb going on, too, for flavor, just on everything right now. Check it out. Alright, we don't have cards for the whiz kid, but it lets you put in codes that fake it into thinking you got cards. Two. Zero. Twenty. What is A? Now, now we're into that sample territory. Get ready. W. O. Z. W. 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 with a start and end point. set to trigger instead of gate so I can get the and then uh, you know one shot so I, I don't want to loop so I got that loop or one shot it's one shot time got a high pitch thing bleeding in with it though so let's see if I can kill that I got a little DI box here that kind of helps
somewhere see what see what's happening here thanks for your patience what am i doing i'm doing a hardware set so i'm like gonna make some music with hardware starting with sampling this thing that's like a speaking spell it's called a talking whiz kid and uh it's from back in the day it's got some speech time and then a uh, beat's gonna happen and uh yeah thanks for hollering brianna or Brahma. I just, I just read Brianna. Okay. You know. Take it to... Thanks for your patience. I'm not going to do this super fast because uh, I'm nervous and I haven't done a stream like this before. But it's going to be juicy if you're patient. See what I mean? Now I'm going to mess with the looper. I'm going to put some stuff on top of it. Get ready. Reverb I like real quick. Get ready. Decisive because I'm nervous. I mentioned that. But I'm gonna do more of these if they're cool. Thank you. 
for it, setting it up. So now I got my loop set up automatically because I got a sync pulse coming from the drum machine that stops and starts the looper once I flip that switch, which arms it. So now, now I can pile layers and they just go.
I don't know if you ever bought a mic stand before, but there's a Euro size, an American size, of the little screw-on part at the end, and they always come with an adapter. And I thought I'd be cool and put the adapter on my keychain, and then I just never ended up using a mic stand with a Euro end, and then now that Euro end situation is the only one I got lying around. And I thought. I just stick it into this thing that holds the pop filter, and I'll be classy. Alas, but hey, we're, we're learning and growing together. Hey, thanks, Brahma. Sorry I called you, Brianna. I'm intending it to be like gaming music, hence the being on Twitch. I hope you follow along. Thanks so much for being here for the inaugural attempt at the uh, hardware creation thing. that sync because I started it off sync I 
was like, oh no, it's over. I'm never gonna sink it again. Lo and behold, it's synced again. You can do anything you believe in. You believe in yourself. It turns out, hey, so if you like this as like a gaming music vibe, if you like gaming, check out another, you know, uh, stream on Twitch called Devin Dust. D E V I N. D-U-S-T, all one word, Devin Dust. He's new to Twitch, but he's been trucking on Minecraft on YouTube. And recently, he did a thing where I did music behind it. And you can find that at greasyconversation.com, or you can just type in waz.lol. So check it out, this name right here, Greasy Conversation. You search for that, and on the website for it, just before the most recent talk show, there's that Devin Dust stream. So you got Minecraft gaming and some on-the-fly music. That I created in Ableton. I, I did that in the computer. It's not this hardware set ambition situation. So, hope you check it out. from your comment. Doogie Howser MD. It's this sound. On the credits.
I did there is I, I got it in the loop. I accidentally got the uh, the sample in the loop. But hey, YOLO, right?
called a breakdown. Oh, you just caught that I have this propped up on a can so that you can see the screen. But then, you know, you can't see the screen because of the way I aim the camera. So that's how we learn and grow, you know? Learning and growing and sharing and doing things together, yeah. <sighs> you know, right? You know? break oh I, hear, I hate that you could probably hear me drink I hate when I when you hear people's mouth sounds it's like the worst thing okay one more you got, we gotta do at least one more you know right yeah come on we gotta all right I heard you okay we're doing it It's kind of whack, but we gotta we gotta commit, right? We gotta commit to it. And this is supposed to move like this. Oh, forgive my finger. Jumped into that lead and almost forgot the scale at first, but hey, we're in that pocket now, right? In the pocket, yeah.
Oh, that's right. Dub, that means that I accidentally left it in overdub mode while I soloed, which means that solo's stuck in the loop now. So part of this is like I'm learning when to loop, when to not loop, when to overdub, when to not overdub. You know, we're learning and growing together, you know?
Got to the butter zone. Pretty sure we're in the butter zone. If this ain't butter, it's a it's a hell of a margarine. What? Oh, that's wet. That's slippery. What?
it was worth and it was worth getting over the fear. Yeah, it was worth talking myself into doing this. I just, I really wanted to see someone do this. And I, I had these things and like, I was making some noises with it. I want to share this. I want people to see. Thanks for letting me show. Oh, I'm tickling the red. Tickling the red, sorry about that. In fact, we got little clips. Hopefully, it didn't come up too clippy because I didn't actually hit zero. I just was tickling the red, you know what I'm saying? On the lights, on the on that VU meter, you know? I think it's a beverage break. Where did he just change? You're probably wondering. Well, I'm gonna aim my finger. No, this way. This way. Yeah. No. If you look this way, then uh, across to the upper right corner, that's the reverb, and I changed it. I just I picked a different reverb. But now. how it feels.
Pushing the red lights, you see my finger here in the upper right, next to those red lights. See that? Pushing them red lights, pushing it, pushing that compressor, getting that pump, getting that that Holmes plate. That's that deep reverb. Got that thick, that thick cloud. We got stuff in the sampler. We got the courage to, you know, this sampler and this drum machine are from 1998. So we've got 20 plus years of gears here. This is not a new keyboard. This has got a good decade on it, too. They don't make this fella anymore. It's the Korg Micro Station. Shout out to Korg. Shout out to Boss for these legendary fellas from the 90s. And, uh, you know, shout out to uh, just do it anyway. Ben Fold says, just do it anyway. You want it done? Just do it anyway. So, holla. And, uh... Check out the talk show and uh, you know, twitch on, keep it trucking. Love y'all.